see how we can integrate the test ng data providers with the citrus integration testing framework as we all know the test ng does comes in with data providers these data providers can be used to execute a test case several times providing different values for every test case that it runs citrus can be integrated easily with the test ng data providers and the parameters can be then used in a test case as variables add data provider annotation is used for providing the data add citrus parameters annotation is used for specifying the parameters that are getting the data from the data providers and again we have the add test function and then we have the add test annotation which takes a property data provider where we specify the reference to the data providers let's see how we can integrate the test ng data providers with the citrus test case to understand open eclipse again we have our citrus project and let's go to citrus test java and let's create a new class and let me give it a name as sample test ng data provider demo now to create a citrus test case with test ng again we have the add test annotation from the test ng we say extends test ng citrus runner let me just maximize the size then we have add data provider annotation that is basically responsible for providing the data now because it provides data it has to be of type object and two dimensional array and let me give it a name as data provider or maybe let's make it more appropriate and change it to messages and then i can say return new it's an object so array array and within this array so let me do a little bit of formatting for you and then suppose i pass in hello pass in by and then a semicolon now we have the data provider we need to pass this to a citrus test case so i'll write at citrus test test data providers it takes a parameter that is of type string because that is what it is getting from here hello welcome by are the strings and let's just see the echoing so i'll say echo and dollar curly braces and the variable name and the semicolon okay sorry i messed it up it's double quotes fine then we say at citrus parameters it is the message and at test and the name of the data provider which is messages so now we don't need test over here done let's execute and see so the test case passes if you would see test ng results it passes test data providers and can you see over here let me just bring this up can you see hello welcome bye so this test case ran three times for different data and if you would see total three and see bye then we have message welcome and then we have message hello so this is basically how you can provide the data so actually integrating j unit data providers or test and ng data providers is very easy with citrus and it just makes use of whatever is available instead of creating its own annotations or its own library so with this we come to an end of this video happy learning take care and bye bye